was reading this article which actually prompted me to make this video. This article reads, uh, and I got it right here, driver shortage has trucking companies looking abroad. I mean, <laughs> okay. So let me go ahead and talk to you guys. But before I get started, of course, if you don't know, name is Brian with Pennington Consulting Group. What I do is I help people start grow and expand their business especially entrepreneurs and i'm here to talk to you if you're in the trucking industry if you're in the logistic industry okay. you need to pay attention okay. you've seen it in the news there's a shortage of drivers and there is loads basically waiting for months in order to get to their destination okay uh it's it's really overnight this COVID thing has absolutely changed the industry drivers are in high demand okay which means people are willing to pay high dollar for you to move freight Okay, so now why is this something that I want to talk about? Okay, I remember being, I used to be a logistics broker uh, and it was at the time when I was a logistics broker, one of the highest uh, overturns, um, you know, in, in the industry, you know, drivers would get hired, fired. It was just such a big problem with finding new drivers. Now, we're seeing that it's kind of has changed because the power used to be in the in the in the driving um, in the logistics company but now the power is not just in the logistic industry and the driving industry the power is going back to the workers the workers are pretty much being given hey tell us what you want because we just want you to come to work there's bonuses been giving out there's so many things that are happening just the average worker in the driving industry it's even better higher bonuses uh, I mean, rates have gone up significantly. You can make some good money if you're in the trucking industry right now. So if you've ever thought about starting a trucking business, more than ever right now is the time to. Okay, number one, when it comes to as far as you being an owner operator of your own truck, it used to be so difficult for you to get your own truck as far as financing right now. Doesn't matter what your score is. You can have a 300 score, you can have a 200 score, which doesn't even exist we can get you funded okay there's actually lease to own options that are available out there you want to click the link in the description to go ahead and schedule a time with me if you ever thought about starting your own uh, owner operated trucking uh, uh right job now, is right the best now. time for you to take advantage of this and actually create a business be your own boss be able to dictate your time be able to dictate how long you want to drive out there okay because before you know all of these were not in your control okay the, the the pretty much whoever you work for dictated how long you're going to be driving when you're going to be home there's some drivers you've been sent from california to new york from new york to chicago you can now control all of that there's there's sites that you can go to with the technology that we have now there are sites that you can go through and choose whatever freight that you want to move flatbed uh, uh dry truck uh, uh you know uh, uh reefers Whatever it is that you drive, or whatever it is that you want to drive, we all know most of the money is in reefers, okay? Uh, I, I'm telling you, I know about the trucking industry, but more than ever right now, it's, it's a perfect way for you to actually develop something and develop a real business. I mean, look at that. The industry is so desperate that they want to go ahead and hire foreign drivers, people from other countries to come to this country to go ahead and drive. Okay, that's because you haven't decided to start your own trucking business. Okay, and, and actually, I should applaud some people that have taken the steps. I've seen it on YouTube and even on social media. I have a close female friend that recently started her own trucking company. You heard me right. A close female friend that recently started a trucking company. I was watching Steve Harvey show the other day, and this, this lady came up, and she, a woman again, that started her own trucking company. So there's the resources in place. Okay, there is the support in place. There is the financing in place. What do you have to lose? You need to get up off your butt and go ahead and get this thing done. Whatever you've been thinking about and any, any and if of any of those obstacles that you have before that was holding you back as far as financing, as far as not having enough resources, as far as thinking that you're not going to get enough loads, all of that is out of the question. Okay? Right now, all of that, you have all of that. So anyway. Uh, what I want you to do is, if you've considered starting your own business and you just don't know what the steps are, uh, how to incorporate, how to get the licensing and all of that, I want you to schedule an appointment with me. Let's go ahead and talk about how we can go ahead and get your business started, uh, walk you through the right steps. We offer resources and, and some of the things that I don't know, I have decided to ponder up with people in the industry that can actually walk you and guide you through the process. It's very simple for you to get your own truck and be driving out there in just a matter of months, okay? If you have your CDL already, you can be driving out there in a matter of weeks in your own truck earning your own money, dictating your own time, and no ceiling on how much you can earn, 
Okay, so anyway, I appreciate you for joining me today. If you don't know, like I said, what I do is I help entrepreneurs just like yourself start, grow, and expand their dream business. And, and for the next couple of months, I want to focus on truck driving to see if we can fix this shortage of truck drivers here in the industry. So we don't have to bring foreign drivers to go ahead and, you know, drive here. There, there's people that can drive. Okay, we have so many people that are just at home right now, not doing anything at all. Okay, that are able and capable to drive and actually create a business out of this. So why do you want to be an entrepreneur? It's something that you've been dreaming about, okay? When you had that job all the time, you thought about all these ideas, okay? And, and it's time for you to execute. Everything is falling in place for you to execute, okay? And that starts with you contacting us. This is one thing that we're really good at is helping people start, grow, and expand their businesses. I want to help you start your dream business, okay? We'll help you incorporate, get your EIN number, get you the lines of credit that you need 50 100 150 thousand dollars in startup capital you can have that okay but just signing your signature no collateral needed it's available right now there's no time and business requirement no revenue requirements no tax returns no bank statements none of that is required simply just you wanting to execute on your business okay so anyway, I wanted to just take this time and tell you to go ahead if you were thinking about starting your business, there is never, there, there couldn't be no more perfect time, okay? This is generational wealth being made right now for people that are actually executing and taking advantage of these opportunities uh, that, are, that are in hand right now. The world is changing so rapidly, okay? It's, I can't even keep up with it, all right? So I just wanted to kind of share that with you. There's gonna be links in the description. If you're thinking about starting that, uh, that business idea or launching your next business, I want you to click the link below and schedule an appointment with me. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about how we can get it incorporated. Let's talk about how we can get you some funding. Let's talk about how we can get you your marketing capital. Let's talk about how you can get your working capital, okay? You, you, you're living in the best times in the world. And if you're in America, you're living in probably the best country in the world in order to get this happen. Let's make it happen for you. As always, I appreciate you for joining me today, and I'll see you on my next video.